Hey guys, it's Jeff with iDownload Blog. Let's talk about, I got a preview for you guys. It is Card Switcher 2.0. It is the updated version of Card Switcher. You know, the WebOS inspired app switching method for jailbroken devices. Now here is 2.0. And what you'll notice is a slightly tweaked cards view. It's actually a little more stable than a previous version and a little faster than a previous version. And you also have three different ways to close out apps with the swipe interface, just like that. So three various ways you can hit the X, you can swipe up or down. And that's really nice. And also, of course, you can tap the app in question and open that particular app, give focus to that particular app as I did there. Now also another new thing is live updates while in multitasking mode. So for instance, if I tap this link here and I load that and I open up Card Switcher, Notice what happens, it still loads while I'm in the multitasking interface, which is really, really nice. So you can kind of observe what's going on with your web pages and whatnot while in multitasking mode. So that is one of the new features for Card Switcher 2.0, but that's not all. Let's go to the settings panel for Card Switcher. Of course, you have your activation methods and by default, it, it activates on a double tap of the home button, which makes the most sense since considering that is how you normally invoke the app switcher. Now on the interface style, you'll notice some changes here. Of course, you have the new grid mode, which allows you to have a grid, and then you see the options that correlate to that particular interface style. And these options will change depending on the interface style you select. Notice you have more options here for cards. Now, the new grid interface style is new to Card Switcher 2.0. It actually replaced the older card flow option in previous versions of Card Switcher. And as you can see, you can see up to four different apps at the same exact time with the new version of Card Switcher in the grid mode here. So this is the grid interface style. You can just tap on it and load it up like that. And you still have the live updates right there in the grid mode. So this is really nice. Kind of reminds me of Orbit, which is another jailbreak tweak. It's like a spinoff of that. Uh, if you've ever used Orbit before, you know what I'm talking about. If you close everything out, you'll see no apps running when you try to invoke Card Switcher. It is version 2.0 and it should be out soon on Cydia. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.